interpretation, or facilitator control. This educational video is intended to draw attention to the problem of facilitator cueing in a technique called facilitated communication. The claim. The facilitator acts as an interpreter or transcriber of words for the individual being subjected to FC so he can run his books. I couldn't have written my books without FC and a good facilitator. I couldn't have written my books without FC and a good facilitator. Source Peter Rowe, November 22, 2012, Final 720. Tony Bryant, YouTube. Questions. Does the narration match letter selection? Is letter selection clear and precise? Do the letters touched make sense in English or any other language? Are the typed words produced independently and without facilitator cueing or control? Narration and letter selection. The way the video is edited, one might expect a narration or audio to match the video, in this case a person's hand pointing to a letter board. Let's see if the person is typing, I couldn't have written my books without a good facilitator. It does not seem likely that the typed words match the narration. But that's okay, maybe they filmed a different FC conversation. Here are some still shots that attempted to capture the moment the board was touched to find out what was typed. Tap 1, W, E, S appeared to touch all three at the same time. Tap 2, N, maybe B appeared to tap B then slide to N. Tap 3, N, M, appeared to touch both letters at the same time. Tap 4, B, N, appeared to touch both letters at the same time. Tap 5, N, M, appeared to tap both letters at the same time. Tap 6, C, appeared to tap on the letter. Tap 7, I, O, appeared to touch both letters at the same time. Tap 8, S, appeared to touch the letter. Tap 9, Y, appeared to touch the letter. Do the words make sense? Given the number of imprecise letter selections, it was difficult to figure out what message was intended. None of the letter combinations made sense in English or any other language. Facilitator Cueing and Control Although facilitators are well-meaning, they are often unaware of the following problems. When they are using a hand-over-hand -hand technique, it is easy to control the typing without realizing it. In this example, the person being facilitated is holding the facilitator's hand
even though in the video it almost looks like he's typing by himself and without physical touch. Notice the fingers underneath his hand near the right side of the video. In this position, the facilitator and client hands act like a pendulum. It takes very little effort to change directions, especially for the facilitator whose hand is underneath and in a more stable position. This hand position also limits range of motion, which might explain the fact that letter selection is often, but not always, limited to the middle of the board and or toward the bottom. In addition, most facilitators maintain constant eye contact with the letter board while the client may or may not be looking. Facilitators are tasked with helping their clients maintain eye contact with the letter board, but they can't do that and keep track of what is being typed at the same time. Recap and Conclusion In this example, the letter selection by the facilitator-client pair was largely inaccurate, with a high degree of multiple letters touched at the same time. As the client held onto his facilitator's hand like a pendulum. In addition, even in this short clip, concerns about facilitator cueing arose as she looked at the letter board consistently, while his gaze strayed away from the letter board. If this was an exemplar of facilitated communication, then it is highly unlikely the words interpreted or translated for the man's books were his own. The Science to date, there's no scientifically rigorous evidence to prove facilitated communication, spelling to communicate, rapid prompting method, or any of their variants produce independent communication. Controlled studies show that facilitators, not their clients, are producing the typed messages. Many organizations oppose the use of facilitator-reliant techniques. These include, but are not limited to, American Speech-Language Hearing Association, American Association on Intellectual and Developmental Disabilities, American Psychological Association, Association for Behavior Analysis, Association for Science in Autism Treatment. FC is not science. For more information, please check out our website at facilitatedcommunication.org.